UMass Boston Baseball taking on Framingham State University on a chilly, windy Monday afternoon at Monin Park. The Beacons Bats came to play to the tune of 13 hits in the game, and they'd get the scoring started early. Nick Palma, an RBI single to right field, puts the Beacons up 1-0 in the bottom of the second inning, and that would just be the start of a big scoring fest for the Beacons, the tune of seven runs on the afternoon. Luke Levitt, as part of a three-run third inning for the Beacons, allows Joey Morrison to score on the fielder's choice as Morrison slides in ahead of the tag. And then Drew Metzdorf, who had a three-RBI day, a two-run double down the right field line into that corner, allows Luke Levin and Mariano Jimenez to score from first and second. You see them right around each other. Metzdorf would end up advancing to third on the play. He would not score in the inning, but the Beacons are up four to nothing. We move on to the fourth. Joey Morrison at the plate, an RBI single to first base, is able to get through the hole, and then he would end up advancing later on the second on the throw. Brian Parker scoring, and just like that, the Beacons ahead, 5 nothing. Then Metzdorf, his third RBI of the day. This single up the middle, allowing Morrison to score. And just like that, Beacons ahead, 6 to nothing. Ross Dexter had a day on the mound. Five innings, no runs, three hits, five strikeouts, and two walks. He ends up getting the win in this affair. As you see his final out of his outing right there. Johnny Zerilli Jr. with an RBI double in the seventh inning helps give the Beacons a 7 nothing lead. Aiden Blake would score. He was 4-4 four for four on the day. With four singles, and he would score twice as well. And then getting back in the ninth inning, the Rams would get a run on an RBI single by Lucas Basile, and the Beacons end up winning this one seven to one. Ross Dexter takes the win in this one. Scott Noski with the loss. The Beacons game against New England College tomorrow afternoon, postponed due to cold temperatures. They will head to the Russ Matt Baseball Tournament down in Lake Myrtle, Florida for the next week, starting on March 9th, this Thursday, against Loris College at 4.30 p.m.